Hello Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Welcome to your monthly singles reading for October 2019. Today we're going to ask the Tarot and the Universe what is coming for you, what you need to watch out for and things like that to do with your love life. Yes. So before I start, I'd like to thank everyone who have subscribed to my channel those who have liked shared and commented those who have booked a private reading with me and donated to my channel as well thank you all so much for your donation and your support and for those of you who are thinking of um, booking a private reading with me or donating to my channel please do check my about page you will find my facebook my paypal my instagram my twitter my websites Everything you need is there and once I hear from you, I will get back to you as soon as possible and we can get your reading done for you. So, Sagittarius, this is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs, okay? So, Tarot and Universe, please tell us what is coming for Sagittarius singles in the month of October. What is coming in their first week? What are they to expect or to be mindful of? right page of cups i feel i should take these okay your second week page of cup uh, page of swords and then the chariot and what is coming in the third week for sagittarius singles oh king of cups okay and the base is five of pentacles okay Right. Let's just give it a moment and see what we are getting here. Okay, okay. There's more water energy here. That's what I'm trying to work out. If these, of course, these are people. These are people coming in for you. Yes, 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 yes. So, Sagittarius, in your first week, I feel you guys are ready for love. Okay? You are ready for love. But I also feel looking at the base here, having the five of pentacles, I feel you guys are feeling like you, you missed something in your life. You are missing something. But I don't feel it's purely because of your love life. But I feel it's some personal issues that is holding you back kind of thing. Okay? So be mindful of that. Because if you're not mindful of this, when someone comes to express love to you, you are going to find yourself being defensive and feeling like you know i don't want you kind of thing or you will feel like they have to explain why they fancy you that's how i feel here okay and what i feel here for you is that in your first week you need to be receptive okay of love that is coming whoever is coming to you is coming to you with genuine love and affection okay so um you don't need to be too protective of yourself there will be no need for that there will be no need for that at all i don't feel that that's what you need to do just be at least you can be open-minded in your first week because love is certainly coming for you and in the second week this is something where 
you start to think, do I really want to be with anyone? Do I want to take this, um, this person on? Okay. But I also feel like having this page here, she looks relaxed. Okay. So I feel you'll be, you be taking things a lot more slow in terms of your thoughts. You know, you'll be doing a lot of thinking, but in a very calm and relaxed way. I don't feel you will be, um, you'll be talking too much. I don't feel, I don't feel like second week you'll be talking too much, but I feel you'll be thinking more about, you know, things. But I also feel like in the second week of October, everyone seemed to be thinking about something to do with themselves personally or to do with your love life, which is quite interesting. You know, second week, October is a lot of thinking time for almost all the zodiac signs yes 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 it is quite interesting but this is you just you know chilling out and uh, i don't feel like this is someone that you are talking to this is you talking to yourself and telling yourself i'm going to take it easy i don't want to stress myself because i also feel like this has also got something to do with the five of pentacles here and um, whatever has happened for you in your recent past is affecting your the way you look at you know things in general. So that is why you are going to be feeling a bit defensive. Okay, I feel this is more being defensive with this page of swords and having this um, chariot here. I feel for some of you, you've got someone coming in who is of, how do I say it? Someone who is um, quite unique for some of you. Someone of great importance. Yes. They are coming in to express themselves to you. They are coming in with love. And I also feel you still be in a defensive mood because they'll be very confident in themselves, you know? Because this is the chariot, very confident. So it's not like they're arrogant, but they, they, they see themselves as a winner. And I feel this will put you off a little bit. And it still connects to this. Okay, but like I keep saying, don't be too defensive. Don't be too defensive, okay, Sagittarius? Because this is something that I feel like you are pushing, you might be pushing away a beautiful relation, possible relationship that is coming to you. Because when we look at your first week, this is, this is true love coming your way, okay? So whatever your personal circumstances may be, don't be overly de defensive because in your fourth week here is the king of cups giving you the cup that you you they feel you deserve look yes a cup offered to you from a smaller one to a very huge cup here okay and this is look at this king here looking at this cup and this seahorse they are very 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 you know into you okay Sagittarius so I feel like whatever your personal issues or personal problems are don't let it get in the way of love try and accept that you know um there's time to let things go and l let love you know have a way in your life Okay, so um, I do I do feel this is a good connection for you. Okay, this is a good connection for you. So um, don't let it slip by. However, it's your life. Whatever you want to do, 
it's totally up to you and i do wish you all the best i have just so you know i've uploaded two uh, pick a card reading one to do with what is going to happen in your location and one to do with pregnancy so if you are um, you haven't watched it yet or seen it yet you can watch that and also you can always watch your general reading if you haven't watched it yet so yes i wish you all the best whatever you do sagittarius and i'll see you next month or you will see me next month